got little pieces of octopus mm. inside it. Ladies and gents, welcome to Cambridge Country Club. Check this place out. Incredible food. Gym, afternoon tea, fitness classes, a spa, a golf shop, a barber's, <laughs> swimming and golf, and much, much more. If you fancy it, let them know you're part of the Food Review Club family. I'll see you soon. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Food Review Club. So we are in Chinatown here in central London for some glorious eating, stuff that's way out of my comfort zone. We've got here octopus takoyaki. Apparently, this is unbelievable. Like, I'm talking singular, one-off, incredible food. Six quid as well for that portion. Let's just pop that there next to, next to the, lucky, the lucky cat. <laughs> And here, just when you think, oh, could it get any better? Yes, it can. This is a Chinese breakfast crepe. Now, the making of this, Callum, was special. Two eggs, lightly spread over. We've got in there, you can't really see a lot, it's a shame, but we've got an English sausage, look, or a little hot dog, so it says on the menu. We've got one of their, like, like a six inch length of that Chinese breakfast dough, bread, whatever it might be, I've never had it before. And you've got this sort of like crispy, like crunchy bit in there as well. With chili flakes, that sauce, like a hoisin type sauce in the middle. People, if you're new here, by the way, hit the subscribe button. We're literally trying to find the best food content we can for you guys. And, uh, this was six pound fifty, I believe, Callum, wasn't it? Yep, six fifty. Here we go. There we go. Look, we've got a bit of everything going on. Up she goes. Wow, that's amazing, bro. That crisp there gives it the maddest texture, and the crepe is not like a pancake. It's more like a a thin omelette. The dough there. A bit like a savoury, a bit like a savoury yum yum. And yeah, you've got that hot dog in there as well, bringing the, uh, bringing the fire. <laughs> that, I've got to say, that is delicious. That was. £6.50. Not bad at all. A lot of mad textures going on in there, Gallon. But none of it feels too much. I'm not sure if it 100% works for my palate, but yeah, it's uh, got a lot of textures, a lot of flavors, a lot of textures, and it does feel very breakfast in. Do you know what? It hits the spot. One more bite. That's delicious. I suppose this is the main event, bro. Octopus, takayaki. I've got a lot of different stuff going on here. Got some sort of like flakes on top. I've got, got some sort of like rich mayo, some uh, some sauce, got some seaweed, sort of flake on there as well. And in the dough. We have pieces of octopus. I've heard big things about this. There we have it. Do you want to try one? Yeah, bro, you take that one. Take that one, take the stick, you take the stick, go on. That is octopus takayaki. What do you reckon? It's got octopus inside it, apparently. Let me try one as well, so I'll get on your, uh, on your level. Like it? One more. One more. Go on. <laughs> <laughs> what would you score out of ten? Seven. Nice score. What was your name, sir? Nice to meet you, sir. We're from, we're from Cambridge. We do food reviews. Yeah, we do. 
Facebook, YouTube, all that sort of jazz. All that sort of jazz. See you later, bro. What an amazing little thing that is. You've got that creamy mayo, that sharp, sweet sauce, the soft dough of the ball, and inside that is your octopus. Let's try and open one up. Here you go, Callum. In the ball. Got little pieces of octopus inside it. Um, wow, that little tiny piece of octopus tastes very fishy. Oh dear, a bit salty. Definitely tastes, for my palate, a lot nicer inside the... Uh, did I say oh dear then? Yep, oh dear. You did, you did. In the dough ball, it kind of equalises itself. You've got that creamy mayo. Interesting, bruv. I've enjoyed that. That's different, yeah? Yep. Chinatown. What other little hidden gems have we got knocking around here? Massive shout out to Todd again for sort of tipping us off about this place. He makes some great content. I'll put his Instagram on the screen now. Um, eating with Todd. My favourite Instagrammer on the food scene. He kills it. He found this and we've followed suit. So... Mad respect to you, Todd. I've enjoyed that one. Time for a score. I'm going to give these a 8 out of 10. Ooh. Not my favourite, but I can respect what I'm eating. Nicely balanced. The breakfast crepe as well was legit. Hope you've enjoyed this video, everyone. Like or follow for more content and subscribe if you haven't already. We'll be back again with more content tomorrow at 6. See us big daddy B pubs and Matt on a mission To find who's got the fastest, freshest food in the kitchen Different places, different flavours, try different things Who's the ruler of ribs? Where's the winner of wings? Who's the king of kebabs? Where's the boss of the bag?